Hello, I'm making a quick video on how to drip feed content. Um, this is in response to a question on the forums. Uh, basically, um, maybe we've got videos and we want to show them certain videos when that user account reaches a certain age. So how I've set it up, we've got our users and I've added a number property for user age. Um, that's not there um, how many years old they are, that's how long they've been created for. Um, and secondly, there is a relationship with videos to say which video they've watched. Because once they've watched it, we don't want to keep showing them. Secondly, we've got a videos collection. And here you've got the delay in seconds. So um, we could have days, we could have seconds, but I'm just doing seconds here. Um, the video URL, you will need that for the component um, and the other side of the relationship there. Okay, so um, we've set up a list here. It's a list of videos where um, the delay seconds is less than the user age. User age is what this number field here. And there's a second property that the current video watched by does not contain logged in user so they won't see any videos that they've already seen um, and there's a button here where the user can click to say they've seen the video and that will add the logged in user to watched by okay so um, about this user age it needs to be calculated so on this link to the videos page we've got an action update user user age current time minus user created date now I've got here times 86,400 that's because I'm using seconds if you want to just have days then don't use that okay but because I'm gonna have days I'll put that back in okay so Okay, so we'll click on videos, and you can see this user is 1,237 seconds long. Um, so we can see here a first video and a second video. Let's look at the what I put in our database already. Our first video is visible if they're one second old, the second video if they're a thousand seconds old, and the third video if they're 4,000 seconds long um, old and uh, this user I've created isn't that old yet so we're just seeing two of the videos so let's now see what happens when the video is marked as complete so if we complete that the video has disappeared if we complete the first video that also disappears. So when this user age reaches 4,000 seconds, we're going to see uh, that third video. Okay. So just to prove that, let's um, let's stop calculating the user age with this um, update user and just manually put on the database the user's age. Okay. So 4,001. Now if we go back. Uh, we should only see the third video now. There we go. And we mark it as complete, it's gone. So this is one way you can drip feed um, any information, perhaps videos, perhaps something else, or a task to the user depending on how long they've, be, uh, they've signed up. Okay, so if we want another video, um, we can just add um, video four, and then yeah, whatever delay we want. Um, again, you can use days, you could use minutes. You just want a different calculation. Okay, that's all. Any questions? Please ask.